One lakh twenty thousand crores of rupees, Mr. KCR said, would irrigate just eighteen lakh acres. In no, in the history of India, nobody has spent so much of money to irrigate just eighteen lakh of new acres. Also, on the one side, it has not irrigated eighteen lakhs. One lakh twenty thousand crores of rupees was spent, and the minister said it irrigated one year. It irrigated fifty thousand acres. One other year, it irrigated sixty-seven thousand acres, and another year in the recent. Season, the minister himself said it irrigated not more than 1.5 lakh acres. So literally, 1.20 lakh crores of rupees was invested, was used up to irrigate only 1.5 lakh acres of land. Doesn't this call for an inquiry? Doesn't this call for an audit? If the cost is on one side, say 1 lakh 20 thousand crores of rupees is already spent. If that is on one side, there is a recurring cost for this project that is going to recur every year because this is a lift irrigation project and the water has to be lifted. The power bills are going to be huge. Even until today, 3 thousand crores was spent just on power bills. And apart from that, the debt servicing of this project is 13 thousand crores of rupees per annum. So there is, in any way you look at it, there is no viability for this project. So on what basis was this was this project commissioned? On what basis was this project even approved? An audit has to be done. We are demanding that an inquiry be done. Also, in the recent times, we have seen this project was actually given permission for two TMC of water per day to lift two TMC of water for 90 days, which means per annum this project can lift 180 TMC of water. But in no particular year, even the project has been commissioned since three years. This project lift that 180 TMC of water. The maximum it lift was around 35 TMC. So even half a TMC is not being used, while the permission is for two TMC, while the spending was done for two TMC. And if the project is not utilizing even two TMC of water, what right or what basis does Mr. KCR want to hike this to three TMC of water? Now KCR is making plans to hike this project to three TMC of water. That means more amount is going to be spent on this project, and then more commissions can be. So this project is literally been a milking, a vending machine for Mr. Kesia. This Kalashram project is nothing but a vending machine for Mr. Kesia. And my question to all the opposition parties is: Why isn't there an inquiry until now? Why aren't the opposition parties fighting for this? In the state of Telangana, we have Mr. Revanth Reddy, who is the Congress chief, and he is the one who is actually involved in a vote for note scam. So if such a person is the main party chief in Congress, then Then there is no surprise that he is going to be sold to the contractors of the Kaleshwaram project. So that apart, the BJP party itself knows that there is huge corruption in the project of Kaleshwaram. Many ministers, like the Water Resource Minister himself or Mrs. Nirmala Sita Raman herself, has gone on record to say that there is huge corruption in the project of Kaleshwaram. So if the BJP party knows that there is huge corruption in this project, then why isn't the BJP party commissioning an inquiry? Is Isn't BJP party the watchdog of India? You are an authority in India. Isn't it your uh, responsibility to commission an inquiry into something that you know is wrong in the state of Telangana? Why isn't an inquiry being commissioned even to this date? Is what YSR Telangana party is demanding all the opposition parties? इलांटे मरीनी वीडियोस को सम पब्लिक वाइब तेलुगु यूट्यूब चैनल नी सब्सक्राइब चीज कोंडे ये पुड़े